Hey guys, welcome to the next episode of the career mode Chepo's Road to Glory and we're in Porto right now, managing Porto. So we did send an offer to Carlos Vela as you guys ask and also Carlos Salcedo, a sub of mine, asked me to bring back Ulises Tavares, a player that we use in our saving Chivas in FIFA uh, 2015. So, um, and also we sent a um, request to Aguilar to join Porto. Also, Raul Dedos Lopez, although we might use Lopez as a right mid, how he plays in the national team. Also, one to Eric Aguirre and Orbelin Pineda, another player that you guys asked me to, to bring to the to the Porto, so we did send an offer to Orbelin Pineda, pretty amazing young player. So for the rest of this guys, we're gonna simulate the rest of the European International Cup. So let's go ahead and see we're gonna win. Yes, we ended up winning guys, so let's go and see. Um, so Carlos Vela did accept, the um, Real Sociedad accepted, so we're gonna send an offer of 142, uh, which is the minimum for Vela. So we're gonna we're gonna go and simulate the rest in the final of the European International Cup, guys. Eric Aguirre has accepted, guys. So he's coming uh, to join our squad. Also, Ulises Tavares, the Mexican playing in the Colombian league, has accepted. Orbelin Pineda has accepted to join Porto. And let's go ahead, guys, and see why Carlos Vela has declined us again. Um, and he just um, doesn't want to come join us for some reason. So we offer him one year. So hopefully he comes. And then Paul Aguilar has accepted. Um, also Dedos Lopez has accepted. He might be a sub right man for us. And Marco Fabian has accepted. And now you guys also asked for Eric Gutierrez. So we're going to try and bring Eric Gutierrez guys. Um, so like, hopefully he does accept to come. Uh, I don't, yes, he does accept to come. So here's coming, guys. He's uh, one of our new signings. So you guys also asked me to recall Diego Reyes from Lone. So we're going to do that, guys. Diego Reyes is back in our club. And I was looking for a striker, guys. I didn't want to bring a striker from Mexico. I did look for Raul Jimenez that you guys also asked, but he did not want to come. Um, 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 Benfica did not let him, wanna let him come because he just joined the club. Also, Guardado trying to get Guardado. PSB does not let, de, let him come. Um, same thing with Moreno. So, we're gonna have to wait um, and play a season before we can bring him. So, we were playing our first game, guys, against Aruca um, versus FC Porto. So, it was gonna be our first league game right here, guys. Tello, which I'm but I'm surprised with Tejo. I'm really enjoying him. I might pick him up on Ultimate Team, guys. Um, and then Ayun with this shot, but uh, he gets blocked right there. And then they get this opportunity, but not a problem for Casillas. And then they got a cross, but Casillas there. Very, uh, very good with the hands, saving us. And then Marco Fabian gets this goal opportunity. And Barcali, the goalkeeper, saving saving the team from losing so right here guys they get another opportunity and they oh what a missing a rebound and casillas couldn't do nothing about that guys so we're down one zero in our first game but then guys look at this marco fabian with the dribbling and he gets penalty marco fabian so we're gonna shoot it with marco fabian the best cam we have ever got uh we were actually gonna use carlos bella but carlos bella has rejected are um, coming to Porto, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna make Marco Fabian our top player in the camp position, celebrating right there, guys, putting us one one. And but the time was not over, guys. Look, Dedos Lopez getting the ball from from all the way he's half and passing, dribbling all these players, guys. No touch dribble and what a shot, but hits the bar and that's not gonna be going in, guys. So we're the game is gonna end in a. Tie, tie, tie guys 1-1 one, one, pretty good so our next game guys our next game on the league was gonna be against um Bo Bovista hope I say that name right guys Bovista so we're gonna be facing Bovista on um, versus FC Porto our first home game so Luisinho taken out there um, and then they get this great opportunity with Manuel with a cross but of course uh, we have a pretty good defenders, so we'll say um, defending pretty well for uh, pretty well for us guys there, and um, the game came in a tie guys zero zero. You guys seen the uh, ninety minutes, 
uh, just before it can see a same in there guys but the game did end it like I said 0-0 zero, zero, not that much on this game uh, but Marco Fabian still wanted to do one last play but no guys so guess what guys Correa has accepted so he's gonna be our striker um, so welcome back our next ga a game was gonna be I guess sporting guys it's sporting so we're gonna be facing sporting on their stadium and this is I, I think this is a pr they're like the mo the one of the, the two top um, kinda I think I think sporting is like the third top um, club in Portugal right um, tell me uh, tell me guys if you, somebody is from Portugal tell me if is sporting a very well known um, club over there because I know Ronaldo came out from from this team right so it has to be good. And then right here, guys, Teo with this great opportunity. Teo passes dribble, everyone. Look at that pass to Correa. What a debut. What a debut, guys, for Correa. And then right here, guys, another penalty. And we get a penalty, guys. So we're going to be shooting that with, with Tecatito. And we're going to shoot that, guys. Let's see who could score this. Oh, what a, and hit the bar, guys, what a miss. I can't believe we missed that. No, Marco Fabian should have taken that, right? And then they get this opportunity, they score on Casillas, making it 1-1, one, one, guys. It looks like we're walking out with another tie on this game. So it has been three ties, so the transfer window was ending, guys. No more deals. We're going to have to wait into the next window, see if we could bring, we tried to sell this guy, although he did not sell. Um, we went into the next window, guys, to see if we could bring someone better to our club. Like he managed that you guys really want to see in Porto. So we're going to have to wait for that, guys. So we we're going to be facing uh, this this club right here, guys. So it's going to be our last game of this, um, of this episode, guys. Uh, Correa with the pass right here to Corona. Corona to Marco. And what a miss from Marco Fabian, guys. And then, guys, Gutierrez with the... Awesome pass to Correa. Correa passes to Tecatito. Look at this not touch dribble by Tecatito. Another not touch dribble and Tecatito is scoring that first goal for FC Porto, making it 1 0, guys. So we're winning our and our first game. Hopefully we could we could keep this lead, guys, and be a um, win our first game. And then Neves, guys, with this shot. And I had to say, guys, I was using Hector Herrera. And I decided to sub him out. Now I'm I'm in love with this player. This is a young player. I believe he's 18 years old. So I, I think he's not gonna be a, a, um, replaceable for me. So right here, guys, a pass to Marco Fabia. Marco Fabia passes dribble the defenders, passes to Teo, and Teo scores. 3-0 in the 37 minutes, guys. So we're winning. Hopefully we could walk out with a win. Hopefully they they don't do an amazing comeback. But right here, guys, try to shoot, but not a problem for Casillas there. And then, guys, what a what a nice um nice tackle by Aguirre, Eric Aguirre, the guy that we brought from Morelia. So right here, guys, they got a corner kick. Um, pretty awesome. But we have their Casillas with the amazing save. Saving us there for a first goal. And then look what a pass to Marco Fabian from Ulises Tavares. And Marco Fabian scores the 4 0 at a 71 minute, guys. Um, I don't see them coming back, so this is gonna be now a goal, Lisa. And then they do this mistake, pass it to Marco Fabian. Marco Fabian passes to Ulises Tavares. Ulises Tavares shoots and makes it 5 0, guys. 5 0. Um, so yeah, they're not coming back. We're winning this, guys. Our, our, our third game of fourth game of the season and we're winning guys and right here Ulises Tavares still got an, uh, another opportunity uh, passes dribble them and he shoots but Marfona the goalkeeper of the other team I'm um, saving that and and look at that save right there guys so we're gonna come with the with the with a corner kick right here another save there and the game does is coming to an end, guys. So we did win our first game, 5-0. A uh, pretty awesome game right there, guys. You see the highlights. Uh, so guys, we're coming to an end of this episode. I, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, guys. And um, I'll see you guys next time, guys. And don't forget to have a very nice day, guys. Yeah.